Hey guys, welcome back. In this lecture, we will look into the time series components. In general, time series data are composed into four elements. Trend, cyclicality, seasonality, and finally, irregularity. In any time series data, you will find these components. Let's look into this component one by one. Trend. Long term and general direction is known as trend. If you look into the figure as shown, which is 13 years of data. If you look into the time series data, it is not continuously increasing or decreasing. It is following some cyclic trend. The cycle is repeating for every 8 years. But overall, if you see, the data is on average is increasing. Such line is called trend in the data. Second component, cyclicality. Cyclicality is behavior in the data where you observe the pattern is repeating over a period. Usually cyclicality is more than a year. As you can see from the data, particularly long term, the pattern is repeating for every 8 years. Hence, this period is called cyclicality. Seasonality is like the cyclicality but usually occurs in period less than a year. For example, let's zoom and investigate the one year data. Here you can observe the pattern in the data behavior. Such behavior usually in one year is called seasonality. And finally, irregular. Irregular is basically random and noisy behavior in the data, which has rapid changes and even shorter than the seasonal effect. Now let's talk about the real-time data of Aravindo Pharma for 3 months from May 2020 to August 2020. This data is available in National Stock Exchange at www.nseindia.com. Let's investigate and analyze its time series components now. If you look into the data which is increasing, to be more precise, from May to August, the price of the Aravindo Pharma is increases. Hence, the trend line will look something like this, which is basically called from the regression line. If there is no cyclicality behavior, there is no cyclicality since cyclicality should be a more than a year. The data what I am having is just 3 months of data. So now let's see seasonality. Every week you can see a pattern is repeating, meaning for 3 days it is increases and for next 3 days it decreases, which completes the period. Such component is called seasonality. And finally, irregular or randomness which we cannot predict or measure. If you zoom and investigate the pattern, in this location which is completely noisy is called irregular. This these are the four important components which is very much required and need to be analyzed which are useful for the forecasting the time series data. Thank you very much. We will continue more in the next lecture on the time series forecasting and analysis.